evening. I hope that you are doing very, 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 very well. Tonight, I present to you another ASMR Conlang Showcase. Tonight, we are investigating seal tongue, the language of my seal folk. My seal folk are very similar to selkies in that they have skins that allow them to transform into seals. Their hair is what connects to their seal skins and sends signals through it, similar to the Navi in the Avatar Blue People movie, but it connects to their skin and this allows them to put it on and control them and that's why they look like seals. Seal tongue is a very ocean inspired language. It is intended to be simple, but capable of being the basis for the slang of all of my selkies and seal folk to form their songs. It is basically intended to be the Toki Ponita of my world, which is to say a language inspired by Toki Pona. And I wanted to throw in some Kalani relationals for a good measure. It's generally supposed to be very minimalistic in terms of word creation, and it should be easy to sing as well as sound vaguely Japanese and Norse. The consonants in seal tongue are b, k, d, g, h, h, l, y, m, n, p, r, s, sh, t, v, and the vowels are a, a, E, I, E, O, I. Seal tongue is a subject first language with the object coming second and the verb slash relational last, all of which are case marked, except for the verb, of course, because that's not a case marked thing. Its adjectives are mostly noun based, though some are verb based. Adjectives are just strung together with the nouns, but sometimes they can come afterwards. This language has prefixes, and in order to describe, if you own something, you put the possessi, and then you put the word of, and then you put the possessor, which is to say, the thing that you own of the thing that is owned. The word for of is ra. No, uh, I had someone try to explain to me what ergative cases were. Initially, I had planned on making this a tonal language, but considering that I am not very good at hearing tones, nor am I very good at saying tones, I decided to leave it out of the language ultimately. This language marks its object, subject, and topic very similarly to Japanese. The object marker is a, the indirect object marker is me, and the topic marker is c. Now let's talk about some conjugation. As per Kaleni, which if you haven't heard of it, please go look it up. The creator of Kaleni is a very talented linguist lady. It has these words called relationals, and they basically act as verbs, but not exactly. So you put them at the end of a sentence, and then they change the relationship between the other words in the sentence. There are four types of relationals in seal tongue. Existence, which is used for if something exists or if something is something else. Change, which is something that exists now how something caused something else, or how something that made something else to become something else. Um, there is the use or do relational, which is something uses something else to do something, or something does something else. And lastly, the possession relational, which is to say something has something else, or something was possessed. And these all change a little bit based off of whether something's happening in the past or the future, and you place them around the relational differently to indicate different things. So word order really matters in this part of the sentences. 
Let's get into some of the lexicon now. Greetings. Get it high. Get it high. And this means high value, literally. But it's an exclamation you say when you meet someone of high value, like your friends. This thing, it, li. Yes, or to be, re. No, is not, da. While, di. What, or how you turn something into a question. E, ye. To, say, or, ho, of, ra, from, by, or for, very similar to the word poor in Spanish, the, they, near, almost, about, then, container, a group, how you make something plural. Roca. All. Sho. And. Then. To. In. At. On. Me. Me. But. De. De. To command, request, or say please. Hi. Emphasis. Yo. Yo. I or me. Ne. You. Tara. Parent. Ergai. Person. Le. Male. Voya. Female. Maya. Skin. Be, mouth, tovo, heart, soul, or center, pari, head, or top, ma, foot, bottom, dhamma, form, body, substance, story, content, haepa, hepa, limb, foot extension, Tie, face, front, river. Time, tadi, recent, new, now, okay. Near, almost, about, soon, senne. Past tense, ago, I. Place, Yo. Open, uncrowded, easy to get lost. Nere. Shop, business, trade. Tio. Near, almost, about. Senne. Inside. Lipo. Hole or cave. Pebble. House, home, source. He. Soul, heart, center, patty. Head or top, ma, limb or extension, tie. Away or gone, lysa. Good, true, say. Circular, round, pull. Artificial, created, woven, thina. Cold, yala. Yaila. Color. Gasi. Gasi. Golden. Ga. Red. Hoya. Blue or green. Seya. Table. Flat. Surface. Plain. Gasu. Paper. Sheet. Thin thing. Here. Tasty. Sweet. Thaha. Same, k, different, strange, or wrong. Dare, dare. Dirty or cursed, 
看呢，看呢。Strong, healthy, not injured. Ga. Thin, length, cylindrical, cylinder, lily. Small, lia, big, seve. Low, deep, black, dark, by, high, bright, light, gere, beginning, end, or any extreme point. D. Want, my, sleep, belly, sing, sora, song, sing, song, sora, play. Dance, merriment, tovo. See, higa, love, shemi. Eat or food, hare. Conflict, fight, naya. Dead, floating, drifting, dai. Daya, daiai, daiai, dai. Smell, sense, become aware. Vega. Sound, communication, hearing. Vosi. Tool, assistant, help. Yohe. Travel, swim. Deme. Hunt, gather. Yay. Fruit, naturally created thing. Vega. Gye. Gift, Senya, Via. Feelings, thoughts, Vora. To break, break apart or hurt. Dagye, Dagye. Can, power, magic. Hela. Name. Word, V, knowledge, belief, Vase, sun, Kaya, moon, Nasha, way, direction, manner, craft, Kopi, picture, image, appearance, Raki, worth, quality, value, Haile, paste, glue. Slime, something that is wet but not water. Nerai, nerai. Plant, reme. Air, wind, breath. Yai. Rock, earth, dirt. Hasi. Ocean, wave, crash. Shama. Water, liquid. Vira. Small creature. Bana. An aquatic or flying creature. Dire, a non-aquatic creature, gahe. Mountain or rise, gasi. Numbers, popo, one. Seru, two. Neni, much, a lot, very. Vasa. Number, keha, keha. To indicate a number of something that is specific but not one or two. You typically say keha and then go boop 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 for as many as there are, and if it's too many, then they will frequently reference other languages relevant to the area. The seal folk are, of course, very nomadic creatures, and tend to blend in with other human cultures, even though they have a culture and ways of their own. Let's read out some sample sentences in the seal tongue. Hello, my name is Nessa. Gere hail, virasine a Nessa re. Or, gere hail, sina a Nessa re. That is literally, I am Nessa. You could also say, gere hail, nete vi Nessa ti, which is I have Nessa for a name. Or, gere hail, ne Nessa me ne vina. I call myself Nessa. Life is good. Si dire to si reme to si sho li ase re. 
which is sea creatures and plants are all good. Or you could say, Shoroka sei ne, all groups are good. Or, the Daiai seire, not death is good. That red thing was very bad. It was the worst. Hoya lida vasa seire, lida vasa seire dyo. In the morning, you will go to the city. Sithene kaya kere atara deme na aese heira roka fo. As for the sunlight, it will cause you to do a journey slash swim to the home of the group is literally what that means. I should fight with you. Ne to taranaya nan de. Which is to say, literally, you and I are not doing a fight, but... And you trail off to indicate that you should. Excuse me, do I know you? Hayo, ne taravasha naye. Please pay attention, do I know you? Is what that might literally translate as. But you could also say it as Hayo sine avasha ra tara tie, which is please pay attention, do I have knowledge of you? They understand my mother because she uses magic. Sia maelera na ahela kofana, deli siroka maele vashana, which is to say, the source female person of me uses power craft. For this, the group does knowledge of her. Last year, there were 1,000. 111 green dragons. Except you can't specify that many because they don't have that kind of precision. So you'd simply say a lot. Which literally means, in a long time ago, there existed many groups of blue green sunflowers slash swimmers. He said, I like animals. Congratulations on your daughter. This literally means gifting is used. Gifting is used for a small female person of you existing. So all of these sentences probably sound very strange to you, but you have to remember that seal folk do have a generally different structure to the way that we think, simply by nature of not really being human. That being said, that doesn't mean that they're any less of people, and they should certainly be treated as such. Just like us, the seal folk can say that they love you, and they'd say this by saying, Ne tara shemi na yo! Ne tara shemi na yo! And with that, I'd like to thank you for listening to my ASMR Conlang Showcase. Ne tara shemi na yo! To you too.